Picture this. You walk into a building and you're surrounded by a multitude of people. To your left and right, you can see couples caught in tight embraces or passionately kissing or both. Where are you? A frat party? Club Zoo? An episode of Pretty Little Liars? No, you're in North Hills, walking to your next class in between periods. Hello North Hills, I'm Noah Petmeyer, and today I want to talk to you about PDA, or Public Displays of Affection. Excessive PDA is the number one cause of disgusted discomfort in the halls of North Hills today. Couples engaging in activities that would warrant a shout of, Get a room! are all too common, and they need to stop. Now, I want to start by saying that not all PDA is bad. There are some types of PDA that are perfectly acceptable, like a quick peck on the lips or forehead, a brief hug, hand-holding, or really intricate handshake routines. But there's also the kind of PDA that's not cool, the kind of PDA that should only be found in one of Shakira's music videos. We call this excessive PDA. Here's what we don't want to see in the halls. Guys doing their best impression of Edward on their girlfriend, girls holding onto the man like they're going down with a Titanic, or couples trying to high-five with their tonsils. And now for some statistics regarding extreme PDA. On average, one witnesses 2.5 cases of inappropriate PDA on walks between classes. 22% of couples admit to having performed unnecessary PDA at some point, and 100% of those couples could have waited until the end of school to canoodle. Finally, 98% of students surveyed at North Hills were strongly against excessive PDA. The other 2% were making out in the corner. If you're still not convinced as to why you need to stop feeling up your date like a fur coat in the halls, you might be interested to know that the side effects of excessive PDA include, but are not limited to, general unpopularity, being late to class, chapped lips, and death. Stares. So next time you and your date think of acting like you're in the middle of a Nicholas Sparks novel, stop and think of the people around you that are collectively puking in their mouths. I'm Noah Petmeyer. Keep it classy, North Hills.